morning, everybody. Welcome to today's episode of Pass the Brewery Review, and we're at uh, Wildcard Brewery. This is exciting. Full eight beers for the flight. Super excited. Let's, let's get at it. Look at this flight. This is the first time I've seen them like this. The flop. That's delicious. Absolutely no complaints there. That was a. Uh... That's fantastic. It tastes like it's got like a flavor. Uh, it's like you know, flavored beers like the uh, mm -hmm, the like iced tea ones and not like stuff like that. I don't think that's a flavored one, but it, that's what they need to accomplish because it had taste, but it didn't. It wasn't overpowering. It wasn't gross. Cali love. I think yeah, I think Cali Love might be a might be an IPA, and you guys know my my opinions on IPAs. I'm not a huge fan, but so it's a little tangy. Still good, like still very drinkable. Uh, it's a little tangy. So, so. Personally, Cardinal Truth. It's a dark one. Dark ones are growing on me, but it's still probably my least favorite type of beer. So we'll give this one a shot. I've never had something like that before. It's a. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's coffee. Like, normally, black beers are coffee. This one's very light for a black beer. I don't know if you can see how. Like, I can see through this one. Um, and it's actually pretty nice. Maybe it's like a very like low key coffee one. I, I don't know. I don't have too much information on these beers today, but um, it, it, it tastes all right. I'll give it an all right, because it's got a taste that's not exactly uh, my ideal beer taste, but How do I explain that? Bitter. I'll give that bitter. Bitter but not, yeah. That's just bitter. I got the right, I got the right word there. Antithesis. Antithesis. All right, this is antithesis. Hold on. I, I, I love these little mason jars with the little handles. Most creative flight, I think. Probably. Can't remember any other ones being this. The glass is being this nice, but here we go. 
antithesis. That's a heavy IPA. If you like IPAs, that's uh, that's probably the drink for you. Personally, I don't like IPAs, <laughs> so uh, that one was kind of rough. It's kind of like a little a little um, fruit flavor to it too. What? There's the first fl first flight is the niche. Yeah. All right, we're moving on to the second half of this flight. It's a lot heavier when they're full. Um, this is my favorite name beer so far. Um, this is the notoriously juicy. I hope it tastes good because I want to buy some bottles. Just because it's got big on, on the label. So I'm hoping this is a good taste of I don't know. Victoria's so juicy. I'm blowing up like you thought I would. Call a crib, same number, same hood. It's all good. I had to say, I don't really care for the notoriously juicy. I'm still probably gonna buy a bottle just to have the bottle. Um, Cause Biggie's Biggie, man. He's the king. You can't, you can't deny it. It's an IPA, that's why. Dang it. Dang IPAs always make everything suck. <laughs> Cloud Mistress, this second half of this, I'm gonna make a, take a moment. The second half of this fight looks exciting, but uh, a little nerve wracking at the same time. I'm curious about this one. The last one. We're gonna head to the Cloud Mistress. <laughs> There's so many IPAs here. That's another IPA, but you know what? I, this one's the best IPA I've ever had. There you go. My uh, mistress, we got some good IPAs. For someone like me who doesn't like IPA. Get out of here, you lying bastard. That's the most sour beer I've ever had. It's like taking a bite out of a line. I'm a big fan of sour, so it's kind of nice, but like at the same time, I wasn't really in the mood to take a bite out of a line. 
So I was surprised. I wasn't expecting it to be this funny. That is a heavy bastard. Purple Sour Ranger. What is the Power Ranger thing? Go Go Power Ranger? No. See that was the biggest sip. That was the smallest sip I've taken out of this because holy oh, purple sour ranger. It tastes like uh, purple sour ranger is very, 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 very sweet. Very, very sour. It's like biting a candy. It's like a candy. drinking a big old candy. Is an unprocessed wine. That makes sense. Like just berries, just like mushy berries. I don't. I'm not sure if I like it. I think I like it. I think it's maybe it's pretty tasty. Oh, I don't know how to prepare you now for sourness. Then you're gonna come here and drink these two. The last one, the last glass. Cheers. Yes. These are cool. We got wild cards. Wild card brewery. In the wild. See the thumbnail? Get him. It's like a lounge in here. You could just chill. You could do, you know. The bar just chilling. It's just, it's cool. There's like cool decor. They really go with the, uh, go with the theme of being a wild car brewery, right? And uh, I'm gonna keep these. I like to take little souvenirs. Um, and they got board games here. They got Jenga, Scrabble, I can see Yahtzee. They got a little tiny, uh, Got a little tiny foosball table. So like you can just come here and chill, hang out with your friends, and that's like that's good. I was surprised at the location. I'm not gonna lie, um, I'm in Trenton, like downtown Trenton, and um, it's which is kind of nice. I didn't have to drive super far to get to this one. I didn't have to go out to tourist country, tourist country to get here. Um, I just, just around the corner from me. And yeah, I would definitely come here again because if I ever want to drink some candy, get the last two beers that I had. Um, 
and yeah, they can bring people here. We can play some Yahtzee. We can play some board games. It just seems like a fun spot to hang out um, on like a rainy day or something. It's not an outdoors one, um, but for inside, it's pretty good. It's good. Yeah, you can have some cool night, fun nights here. I'm gonna get one of those notoriously juicy though, because just to put it on my shelf, because how can you not have a beer that has Biggie on the, on the, on the label? Come on. So, uh, yeah, I think that's all for this episode of Pass the Brewery Review. Thanks for watching. This has been Wildcard Brewery. Good night, everybody. All right, Wildcard Brewery in Trenton. Not bad. You did good.